Hello, this is Lucas Palmeira from Imaginando and I'm here to give you another tutorial on the RC. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make the bass line and the high synth from the song Sunglasses at Night from Tiga. So, to start, I'm gonna open a DRC on a default patch like we normally do. Okay, here we have it. And we are going to start by changing the mode from poly to mono. And on the filter, we're changing the low for pole filter to a band pass to pole filter. And we're gonna drop the cutoff to about this much. And raise the resonance to about half. And the envelope generator to modulating the cutoff frequency, we're gonna raise it to maximum. Like this. Now, for the first envelope generator, what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna raise the attack a little bit to about 0.05, like this. We're gonna drop the sustain to zero, like this. Now, on the second envelope generator, we're gonna drop the sustain to zero. Okay, and this should be it. Now, let's give it some delay. We're gonna turn the sync on to 1 8 Okay, give it a little bit of feedback. Okay, like this, one eighth. Okay, should be about enough. Now a little bit of reverb. And it should be okay. Now let's go for the bass sound. I'm gonna open another DRC on a second channel. Okay, here we have it. Same thing, I'm going to change the mode from poly to mono. Here I'm just changing the octave on the keyboard, like this. Okay, and now I'm gonna raise the pre-gain to about this much and drop the master a little bit so we get a little bit of saturation. Okay, now I'm gonna drop the cutoff filter to about one quarter and raise the resonance to about half. Now I'm gonna raise the envelope generator control cutoff to about this much. Okay. Now on the first envelope generator, I'm gonna drop the sustain to about this much and the release to about this much. And on the second envelope generator, I'm gonna drop sustain to zero. Like this. Okay. Raise the pre-gain a little bit. And give it a little chorus. Okay, like this. Okay, and this should be it. Let's now listen to the melody that I've played before. Okay then, so let's listen. And this is it. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe to Imaginando's YouTube channel and I will see you again next week. Goodbye.